Here I have a palette of four colors. One is a highlighting color and the other three are liquid eyeshadows. The first is ethereal and I used it on my brow. I blended it with my finger. I just touched it on a little bit. It's highly pigmented. A little bit goes a long way. And then next I'm going to place it on my cheekbones, at the top of my cheekbones, tap it on a little bit, and then blend it with my finger. It gives a nice glow, ever so subtle. And then I went to the other cheek and did the same. Just on the very tops of my cheekbones. Very careful not to go in too far. If you have a very slim face, you can go in a little farther. I put it on the top of my lip. It creates the illusion of bigger lips. If you need that. And then I place it on the center of my nose and I'm sure not to go down too far to the tip of my nose, which I did a little bit, but I wiped it off. Okay, so um, next on the palette, I use a matte eyeshadow. It's a liquid eyeshadow called Brown Canvas. It's a very natural brown. It's pretty light. It's a very, very nice color. It's very subtle, it's very natural. You can use it as an everyday brown. This brown color goes on all eye colors. Um, particularly blue eyes will really do well with this color. The next two colors are liquid eyeshadows and they're both shimmer colors. I use, the next would be Golden Stars. It's a golden color, and I placed it on the center of my eye. It's very nice for the holidays or an evening. The shimmering is not too shimmery, so it's okay for women 50 and older, women my age or older. I placed it in the corner of my eye just to highlight that area. It makes your eyes look larger. It's very, very beautiful. And I just went over to the corners again. On the up, upper and lower, just right around the corner to create an illusion, a highlighting uh, illusion of larger eyes. And that's called Golden Stars. The next one, I used an eyeliner brush. And I'm using Bronzy Gaze. It's the darker brown. It is a shimmer color, again. I started at the outside corner of my eye and into the crease, just a little bit for some definition. And then I went over to the other eye and did the same. Just go at an upward angle through the crease and fill that in on the outside corner. I also use this eyeliner brush for underneath my eyes. This color is subtle enough to use as an eyeliner. Kind of, you can use it as a, a smoky eye I didn't go real smoky, but just a little bit. It's nice and you can smudge it to give a nice evening look. And this is kind of a natural evening look. So I just did it right below my eyes. That was it. Very glowy and beautiful. These highlighters and eyeshadows are absolutely wonderful. There's the final look.